guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I'm going to be bringing you a mango clothing haul and I recently picked up kind of some autumn or fall whatever you'd like to call it pieces. I know we're technically still in summer but it is unfortunately starting to get colder here in Ireland and it's like raining every single day so I couldn't help myself and I did pick up some like jumpers and stuff that I really wanted to share with you guys. So if you would like to see everything that I bought just keep on watching. Okay, so the first item that I picked up from Mango are these really cute and pretty basic white runners. As you all know, if you saw my previous H&M haul, I do have it linked below if you wanna go give it a watch. I did pick up a pair of white runners and I have been wearing them so much and I'm starting to get them wrecked. So I knew I needed to get my hands on similar ones. Um, so I found these ones in Mango and I love them. I got them in a size five and they were only 30 euro. They're a little bit heavier than the ones that I bought in H&M. So the quality seems slightly better and they are leather so they'll be easier to clean. Whereas the other ones were just like a material, like a, I don't know what you'd call the material. So these ones are a lot easier to clean and they have a bit more detail on the back as well. Kind of like a crocodile leather print. Very lightweight, I love them. Size five, 30 euro, you can't go wrong. Okay, the next item that I got, I'm not exactly sure and I will need your help in the comment section below. I did pick up a pair of high-waisted mom jeans and I wanted another pair because I wear my light colored ones so often. I wanted to get a bit of a darker pair coming into fall and I got these lovely ones and I got them in a size eight. They are high-waisted, like I said, but I feel like they might be slightly too big in like the crotch area um, and I will have the clip playing. So be sure to let me know in the comment section below what to do. I don't know, should I keep them? Should I return them? Probably gonna pair a belt with them as well, like I do with all of my jeans. But I just, I don't know, I don't love them as much as I thought I would. They are lovely and I love the color, but just the fit, I'm not 100% sure. So make sure you let me know in the comment section below, what will I do? I need your help. the next item you're all going to be sick of me I know I wear blazers all throughout fall and winter so I did want to pick up a new one to add to my collection and I got this gorgeous linen blazer in mango I got mine in a size small and I think the prices are all covered up but I do have them linked below I'm pretty sure this was about 25 euro possibly 30 could have been cheaper I can't remember but I do have them linked in the description box below if you want to pick these up so like I said, I got a gorgeous linen one and it has a lovely white pinstripe going down through it. Very lightweight. The color is kind of a beige mixed with gray. And um, so this will go with everything. Of course, my wardrobe is literally full of beige, white, brown, very neutral colors. So I thought this would go perfectly with all of my other items. I could picture this maybe with like a white t-shirt, some high-waisted jeans, maybe even the mom jeans that I showed you before. This could be a gorgeous outfit as well as the white runners. Getting ahead of myself here. Um, but yeah, this is the blazer here. I love it. It has two big pockets on the front. It is quite long. Um, so this could also be paired with leggings. Um, I set the size so small. And oh, and also I love the button detailing. It's like a wooden kind of detail here. Really cute. You just can't go wrong with having a good staple blazer in your wardrobe. And if it's a neutral color, I love it. <laughs> Again, pretty basic, but I have so many of them in my wardrobe because I destroy them with tan. Um, I just picked up a white t-shirt. Now the neck on this t-shirt is kind of like a cowl neck. It's quite round, it's not a v-neck, but it kind of scrunches up to give it that cowl neck effect. I got mine in a size small, and I think this was about nine euro. The quality feels so nice. It's kind of like, it's not a heavy top, but it's just, you can tell it's good material. It's very, very soft. This goes with anything, jeans, leggings, whatever you're feeling. You can't go wrong with having a good white t-shirt in your wardrobe, so I'm very happy with this. For the next item, I know some people might have mixed opinions because I think sometimes, or so I've heard, some people think it makes it look like you work in the shop. 
but I picked up a top and it also says Mango on it. Now I know this kind of could pass as a uniform for all the employees of Mango, but I think it's really cute. I really like it. I love the stripy detail to the top. I just love going for basic looks, going into work. These would be perfect with jeans and you could dress it up with a blazer like I do with everything. This top, I got it in a size small and I believe this is only about five euros, so very inexpensive. I love it. I think the whole mango detail on the front just changes it up rather than being a basic stripy t-shirt. It has something on the front just to spice it up, you know? So let me know what you think in the comments below. Would you pick up something that has a logo of the shop like Mango, Zara, H&M? Because I definitely do. So I would love to know if anyone else does. I am very excited about this next piece and it's probably my favorite thing from the whole haul. And it is this stunning cropped cardigan. Guys, this is so soft and I cannot wait for it to get really cold so I can start to wear this. I got mine in a size small. This I think might have been around like 25 or 30 euro. Um, like I said, it's slightly cropped. So this with high waisted jeans looks gorgeous. You don't actually need a top underneath it, even a string top just to add extra warmth. But the jumper itself looks really cute alone. Um, it's kind of like an oatmeal color beige mixed with cream and the buttons on it are just stunning. I love them so much. They're just so cute. It's a lovely detail to the top. The sleeves on it are slightly like puffy. They kind of scrunch in and puff out which makes it look really pretty and really girly. So this is definitely my favorite piece from the whole haul. I'm probably gonna wear this so much throughout fall. I love it so much. <laughs> final item it is just this cardigan here again guys so soft this almost feels like it's cashmere it's that soft i got this in a size small and i think this was 30 euro maybe 35 euro it's just a oversized cardigan it's quite long this would be lovely with leggings or jeans and it has a lovely tie detailing just to give it a bit more structure and shape it is quite heavy so it could pass as a coat as well for kind of those warmer into colder evening what am i trying to say i don't know it's just nice it's quite warm um, and it has a ribbed detailing on it as well it's slightly like the light is making it look quite pink but it is beige with the pink undertone and um, but i love it i cannot wait to wear this it's like a dressing gown and it feels like cashmere <laughs> Okay guys, and that is it for today's video. I really hope you all enjoyed this mango haul. Like always, I will have everything linked in the description box below. Like all of my hauls, it's all information down below. Make sure you click it if you want to pick up any of these items yourself. Be sure to let me know in the comment section below what to do about those mom jeans. I am really torn. Should I bring them back? Should I keep them? I don't know. So I do need your help. And also let me know what you think of all the other pieces that I bought. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I would love to have you as part of my YouTube family. And like always, guys, I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye, guys.